Well, as the weather begins to cool down, children's temperatures, uh, children's temperatures tend to warm up this time of the year. In order to protect children from the flu, Essentia Health is reminding parents to get their children vaccinated. Now, Logan Gay has more. To ensure that your children are happy and healthy this winter season, pediatricians are recommending that parents make sure that their kids get vaccinated. We encourage everyone six months of age or older uh, to get a flu vaccine. Um, this recommendation comes from the Centers for Disease Control. Leaving children unvaccinated can lead to future serious outbreaks. We live in a community. Uh, we live among a population. And to have uh, a population of children or adults who are not immunized puts all the rest of the population at risk. So the more people that get immunized, the more effective the vaccine is. This year, because of the findings from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, Essentia Health has changed some of their flu vaccination options. A newer vaccine that's been on the market for several years is the nasal flu mist vaccine, which is a live virus vaccine. Unfortunately, uh, after reviewing the effectiveness of that vaccine, seen over the last several years. It was determined it wasn't as effective as we'd hoped it would be. So it has been taken off the market for this year. So all we have now is the injectable vaccine. To make the experience right, more comfortable for children, Essentia Health encourages parents to use a new comfort technique. We do everything we can to minimize the pain with the children. We do something called a comfort hold uh, to distract them, to help um, uh, get them through the pain of the injection. So far, parents that have used the comfort hold believe it makes the process easier. It was great. I think it comforts them. They don't really even realize what's happening and it goes by so quickly. And Baxter, Logan Gay, Lakeland News. Essentia Health Clinics are offering 10 minute appointments at all of their locations. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.